What's up guys? First off, I've been seeing stuff in Australia and it seems pretty horrific. I've always wanted to go to Australia and someday I hope I do go and see it and see all the beauty that it has. But, but a lot of that has been burning up these past few weeks and I want to use this platform and incorporate you guys to help out in some way. So for every 10,000 views that this video gets, I will be making some sort of donation to the Australia bushfires to help control that. So by just watching this video, you are helping contribute to all of that. And don't forget to share and like this video so a lot more people can get involved with this and that will help me make a bigger donation. So thank you guys in advance for all the support and I can't wait to see what comes out of this. But without further ado, let's get on with this beautiful shipping container home. Guys, this home is magnificent. It's definitely one of my top favorites so far that I've been to. And today I'm gonna to give you guys a tour of this home. This home is located on Airbnb. I'll leave a link to that down below. And if you wanna check it out, and maybe stay here at some time. Also, I'll leave a link down below to the owner's website. They have another home that I'll be doing next week, but no sneak peek for that yet. You have to check out next week for that. It is also very cool. The first home we are doing is this one. It's a single unit shipping container home with this massive cover deck attached to it. It's perched right in this woodsy area, so it gives it a great vibe. Also down below, if you decide to stay here or anywhere else in the world on Airbnb, sign up using my link. You'll save $40. I'll save some money too. It's a win-win so check out my link down below so all of that is in the description so I don't want to waste any more of your time let's get on with this tour because it is magnificent this is a very charming intimate container home whenever you pull up to this property you have plenty of parking and you walk up the steps and you are at the container home on the right you have a nice fire pit to enjoy at any time of the year it's really nice and cozy and who doesn't like a nice campfire back over to the home the shipping container is black they painted it black which I really like that fits my aesthetic and they would the wood they use to accent this really fits well. I love that light colored wood mixed in with this black. It looks super beautiful. They put it up on this foundation so everything kind of electrical and all that stuff is underneath it which leaves plenty of more space for inside the home since this is only one container unit. And the surrounding property is just really beautiful. I think this home just fits in really nicely and it stands out and it just looks great. So as we continue on with this outside porch area, it is covered. There's lights all around it for at night. It just gives you that nice cabin cozy vibe. But the first thing you see on the right is this massive swinging bed. It is amazing if you like to take naps outside in the summer or you just like to swing on it. It is super comfortable and large. It can fit a couple people if you want. And right next to that is the wood for the campfire. But we'll continue on. And next you have the seating area for the outside. A couple of you guys can sit out here and chill. And it's right next to the garage door that does open that can lead into the living room area of this container home. But we'll get to that later. It adds a nice aesthetic to this container home it looks super cool and I think it is one of my favorite features but like I said we'll get to that if we continue on you got a grill for grilling in the summer or anytime and then last you got the gorgeous hot tub because what place isn't complete without a hot tub. You gotta have a hot tub. You can use that any time of the year. It is super clean and large. I love it. And it's basically blocked off with this end of a container home. So what they did, they just swung out the doors, kind of secluded the porch area on this. I love how they incorporated the container into that and kind of made it more intimate in this area. One cool thing about the hot tub is I always thought it was a pain to take the cover off the hot tub and put it somewhere. Well, they have this bar mechanism to where you just flip it and fold it and it stays right on one end. It is so easy. I don't understand why not every hot tub has that. That is something really cool that they added. But now let's get in on the inside with this marvelous container home. When you walk in, you can see it's very spacious and roomy and it just feels really intimate. It doesn't feel cramped or crowded, which a lot of homes do whenever they're kind of tiny, but this one does not at all. The first thing you notice though is the kitchen. Now with the kitchen and really everywhere else in the home, they took attention to detail to the next level. Everything is super high quality and really nicely done. And if you stay here, you'll notice that as well. I love that kind of stuff, especially whenever you're making a piece of art kind of for a home. I think all that stuff is really important and the owners here nailed it. So at the kitchen, you got lots of countertop space and lots of cabinets that are really well designed. All the cabinets have the utilities or utensils that you need for anything that you need in the kitchen. The only thing that is missing is an oven, but they do have a stovetop and a microwave for anything else you might need. They do have pots and pans 
and they just provide a lot of things here. They even provide metal straws, which I have never seen in an Airbnb. So props to them for that is super cool. And they even got a really nice aesthetic fridge that fits this vibe of a home. Whenever fridges like this or incorporated in homes, I love it. Above, you got the open cabinets that make this kitchen feel even more open that you have all your dishes in and they provide wine for you. And if we continue on, they got this massive sink that is right in front of this huge window that lets in tons of natural light. That window, along with the one above the shelves up here just really let in a lot of light and it's really nice a window like this it always makes the home feel a lot more cozy and right behind you you got towels and free slippers for the hot tub which is amazing <laughs> so we'll continue on and on the left side right here you got this fireplace that was designed to fit in and not stand out really with the home it is white along with all the walls and everything super clean looking and sleek and in the winter you got to have a fire on the inside to add to that coziness and right above it you got the tv it swings out so if you're on the couch you can see it if you're in the kitchen you can swing it out in the kitchen you can see it anywhere and right behind that you got the seating area which is pretty nice if you ask me these two seats in this table look fantastic and it is really comfortable to sit at actually and eat breakfast or dinner or whatever super nicely done there as we continue on with the home you got the living area now this is a really special area because you got this garage door that you look at and you can open up this garage door. It's automatic for in the summer. You can incorporate the inside and outside and it just makes this place feel huge and incorporates the people outside with the inside and it's just super beautiful. I love it so much. Even in the winter if it's closed, it provides a ton of natural light and it just makes this place feel even more large than what it actually is. So this is one of my favorite parts of the home and it requires no effort. The couch, it fits in with everything very beautiful you got this nice wooden coffee table which is super cool right in front of it and we just continue on you got the bathroom the bathroom is really large for what this home is and it is super sleek and modern and nice just like the rest of the home on the left you got a beautiful sink and right behind it you got the toilet and above that you got all your amenities you need for the bathroom and over to the left of that you got the huge shower which is always nice to have and this room is just bright and nice and really open and it feels really cozy you can close it off from everything else Else. but if we continue this door right here is the last part of the home which is the master bedroom it's the only bedroom in this home but it's very lovely your eyes are instantly pulled to the huge window that takes up this entire wall and it lights up the room you can wake up to the sunrise in the morning and enjoy your time in this bedroom it is it is pretty large for what it is now the other space in this bedroom is used for storage you have your dresser on the side they can put stuff in or you even have drawers underneath the bed to put all your stuff in so there'll probably just be two of you staying here all your stuff can fit in this area and to top it off with this room is one of my favorite parts of this home as well along with the garage door is this tv now this doesn't even look like a tv i thought it was a picture at first but they framed this tv to kind of blend in with the wall and it just looks super sleek and modern and it's right perched perfectly whenever you're laying in bed the two of you can watch tv watch whatever you want it is really nicely done. I couldn't ask anything more from this container home. It has everything I think it needs and it just tickles my fancy in every way. I would love it. I would stay here again another night and bring other people to show them from the black on the outside mixed with the wood and the wooden beams to the garage door to the inside. It is super, super nice. I would suggest this home to anybody. This home is located in Ohio. So if you are in the Ohio region or traveling through, definitely make a stop at this place or check out their other places down below through their website that they have on this property. The homeowners are super nice. You'll not have any issues whenever you stay here. They pay a lot of attention to the cleanliness of their homes and just the quality of them. So you will not miss out on anything here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and supporting all my other videos. Leave a comment on what your favorite part was of this home. Share this with somebody. Send it to somebody that you would want to take on a weekend trip here and experience this together or share it so you can show all your friends on Facebook or whatever. That would be highly appreciated. That helped me out a lot. And don't forget to leave a like on this video. If you have an Airbnb or a home that you live in and you think it deserves to be shown off to the world, shoot me a message or email me and send me some photos and maybe we can work something out and I can come and make a video about it. Stay tuned to next week because I will be showing off another home in this property. It is a lot different than this one, but it's just as nice. So I'll catch you guys next week.